Tell your children that Allah is with you wherever you are. It's a verse of the Quran. وَهُوَ مَعَكُمْ أَيْنَ مَا كُنْتُمْ And then you tell them that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is with you because everything depends on Him. You depend on Him. Everything around you depends on Him. He's not absent anywhere. As you say this, you're doing two things. The first thing is you're explaining to your children that they can't go and hide in a corner where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala can't see them. And when some parents, they tell their children that Allah is everywhere, then this is what they intend. They intend that you can't hide in a corner. Whatever you do, Allah is seeing you. And if a little child, that's what he understands from this expression, it's okay. But we know that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala isn't physically in every single location. We're not pantheists. But the relation of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala with his creation is a relation of dependence. It's that he creates and sustains every single thing at every single moment. And there's no closeness that is closer than this. So when you tell your children that he's with you wherever you are, and then you explain that he is the one who creates everything and sustains everything, then you've conveyed what you need to convey and they've understood um, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is beyond space and time in a language that they can understand.